Okay guys, as you can see here, we got a new entry grade in 144 scale from Gundam Build Metaverse. We got the LAHH Gundam for a thousand yen, which is, I think it's, yeah, it's like 10 bucks, is it? Ah, 740 plus the tax, you know, 10 bucks just to round it up. As you can see, comes on October of this year. Entry grade, of course. And I gotta say that the sound is gonna be it's pretty meh, honestly. It's just the RX-182 with some beats and pieces and different colors. Like, I don't like how they did this thing with the beef in here. And also, like, the shield looks cool. Legs are... these legs are pretty meh. Feet are nice. Beam rifle is just a normal Gundam beam rifle with a different color on sight on it. And then they put these weird um, half circle things on it. Kind of look like pizza slicers, honestly. <laughs> I don't know why. Now the back here has this backpack which is nice. You know looks like it has a uh, attachment point here for something else and it has this lens I think it is yeah it has this thing there so let's do have some good articulation I mean oh you can attach the shield on the back but this isn't really anything that special now if you're wondering what is the metaverse zero well the metaverse is this it's the new Gundam series, and as you can see here, it's the new poster. Um, this is pretty much, yeah, this is the next Gundam build, as you can see. And that's pretty much what you're getting here. This is the poster, you get uh, SD Gundam here. Uh, it looks like one of the bad ones are gonna be uh, Barbados. You got this Gundam, which is gonna be the lead. You got the Fumina here, you got the different characters. And I can honestly, I can tell you right now. Waifu, 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 and rivals. <laughs> and the bag looks like the big bad is gonna be I don't know. That kinda I uh, I know this is pretty much has to be like a cycle gundam, but what's inside there hmm kind of hard to tell I kind of want to say hey is the Eclipse Gundam in there but then I see the chest and I'm like no, no I don't think so um and also I don't think this is this is Psycho Gundam I think this is the thing that uh whatever I give up on no I don't know really what to say but yeah uh, that's our first look at the new Gundam from the series, the Lot Gundam. So, I was gonna end the video off and then this appeared. <laughs> yeah. So, this is the other one. Also comes out in October. As you can see, also our entry grade is called the Bill Strike Exceed Galaxy. Yes, for 1,100 yen. So, pretty much around the same price range, you know, around that 8 to ten dollar mark and I gotta say I love this this design a lot more than the other one a lot more than this I think this design is pretty nice because you have the little cycle frame here um, well if that is a cycle frame I don't know anything the series hasn't started yet is uh, the beam rifle is really crappy let me tell you about it this beam rifle looks pretty crappy the shield looks good but it has some attachment points here and the beam rifle as well so I wonder what you can do with it of course like the chest like the shoulder pads like the legs the feet are nice and of course the head looks great check that out I love how it has actually it looks like a bean saber attached to his shield which actually looks pretty darn cool check it out from the back oh it looks like it has a core fighter on the back this this thing looks like a core fighter actually 
It, I could be wrong, but oh no. Look, it has a little cockpit and it has the shape of a fighter, so. Mmm, I'm liking this one. I like this one. I like this one. Okay, that's cool. No more pictures. Aw, oh, man. This, this one is cool. And you can see it has different attachment points. So, out of the two, this one. This one is the one that I would get. Man, that is. This one is cool. Okay. So, I cannot wait to see more of this guy. Hopefully, there's more stuff. Some more Z. Because, like I said, I think this is a gore fighter. If you were able to detach it and add stuff to it and then add a bunch of stuff here, 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 that is going to be pretty awesome. Like I said, the Bing Rifle looks pretty puny. I don't like it, but but the shield, you know, the shield has this blade there. Who knows if the beam rifle, you can attach this to the beam rifle or, or something to the side and make it a lot bigger or better looking. So we'll have to wait and see. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys next time.